All right, so we're gonna start filleting some fish here. So you're gonna take your first cut straight down like this. You're gonna feel the backbone start, and that's where you're gonna turn your knife towards the tail. And then you're just gonna ride along that, cutting through the ribs, right along that backbone, right along the dorsal fin, right there at the top, right here's the dorsal fin. So you just wanna kinda of cut right along that backbone straight down towards that tail, riding that backbone the whole way till you get to the tail. One fillet off. Don't mind the internals. Send, you flip your fish over, lift the fin up. That's a good place to hold that front fin. Stream, same thing, straight down through. Feel the backbone, turn your knife towards the tail. Follow along the backbone. Right there, just keep a hold of the fish. Sometimes I might have went a little too deep. It's okay. You seen how I brought the knife back up? Straight down through, riding the backbone. There you go. The whole way through. Not too bad. A little bit, but you'll get better the more you do it. Even with practice, you can see I still am the best. All right, so now that you got one off, you're gonna to wanna to get rid of the rib bones. Just kinda of go right through and you're just gonna kinda of roll down past them, roll right up them. Make sure you get them off. There you go, see? Oh, looks like I missed one. Come back in, pick that one up, no biggie. Now you're pretty much all good. You can kind of feel, see if you feel any bones pecking up or anything. Looks like there might be one right here. Nope, we're good. So now we're gonna take the skin off. I like to use a fork to hold the tail. Some people just do it other ways. That's my preference. I just kind of use a little bit of a sawing motion on the skin. Pardon the knife, we're at camp, so it's not the best one. Forgot my good fillet knife at home. All right, so I take the skin off. Skin comes off. I just keep a scrap bucket down on the floor. I'm not just throwing it on the floor, so. I like to get rid of a little bit of the belly fat down on the bottom of that fish there. And then there's some little Y bones up in here from the ribs, they wrap around. They kind of go towards, you wanna take your knife and kind of cut towards yourself a little bit. And then kind of just go down to there. And then the same thing, just right there. You can kind of feel them with your thumb, fingers in there. They're right in there. You can just kind of see this vein that kind of runs up through there. It's kind of the backbone and the other side of the ribs. Like I said, just get rid of that. And one fillet, all clean. Ready to be deep fried or fried in the skillet, however.